All right, this is some of the detail about installing the Magura 271, I think it was, hydraulic clutch on the uh, Yamaha, older Yamaha WRs with compression release instead of the hot start lever at the handlebars. So I used the longer adapter here. I had to put use all three of their um, shims here because it needed to preload the um, the hydraulic shaft in order to get the right amount of movement on the collector. I uh, had to disconnect the banjo bolt in order or in order to run everything down through the frame properly. And then when I did, it, I found out it was helpful because then you can orient the cylinder and the cable to route properly. So you, you're going to want to loosen the banjo bolt and just adjust that properly. Um, yeah, so that's that part of it. It seemed to go smooth routing it through the frame. I did buy a bottle of Smogura blood. The um, this came in handy because it took a lot, after I disconnected that banjo bolt, it took a lot to bleed the system. Okay, so I learned a couple things about this. I had to move the adjuster all the way down and the lever and the cable is just barely long enough to get this into the lever. Okay, you can see I filed this a lot. Focus. That side is much shorter than the bottom. The cable now just barely fits. Okay, I filed the other side, the part you can't see here, enough. To get it to go in the groove. So the cable now just comes through here and just barely makes the corner. I shaved a little bit off of the bottom edge and the inside corner so that the cable can make the turn. Alright, as you can see, very little slack. The adjuster's all the way out. Just comes out right. This is the side that I filed down. Now I will take the lever, feed it into the groove, make sure it wraps, and voila! going to work. Okay, here we go. Little Loctite T15 Torx. All right, let's see. Looks like it's working. <laughs> 